All right, so in this video, we will install Laravel on Mac. Laravel requires PHP and Composer. Your Mac machine most probably has PHP pre-installed, and this is good. You can start right away with your Laravel project. However, there is a catch. Your pre-installed PHP version is probably older than the one required for Laravel 5.3. So we will use the terminal to see which PHP version we own. First, let's make sure we have PHP pre-installed as I said earlier. Which PHP is the command that will tell us if we have PHP installed and which installed PHP is used. In this case, the pre-installed PHP that comes with the OS is used. My current OS is El Capitan and you can verify it right here. Okay, now let's see what PHP version we currently have available. PHP minus V. Okay, so the version is 5.5.36. Let's see whether this version is enough to start with Laravel 5.3. Well, it is not enough. The documentation says that PHP 5.6.4 or higher is required. Those in this case we need to upgrade. What about upgrading to PHP 7? Let's do it. I will download XWAMP with PHP 7. So let me do this. We will scroll down PHP 7. So make sure it is 7. Once it is downloaded, install it. The steps for the installation are very easy. Just next. So we open this. It requires a password. So next, next, next. We will uncheck this. Next, next. When the installation is done, the next step is to make sure that we have PHP 7 now. Uncheck this and click finish. So back to the terminal and you already know the command php minus v. Okay, it looks like we still have the pre-installed php version. Let's verify it. Which php? Yeah, so the operating system is still using the pre-installed version. Those we need to change it to the new php version. No problem. Clear the terminal. And open bus profile using vim. So vim slash dot bash underscore profile. Press I on the keyboard to insert a new line and you have to type here export path equals to. So now we specify the path to PHP that we just installed with exam. Applications, xamp with uppercases, xamp files, bin, and here dollar sign path and that's all once you specify the path press escape on your keyboard and colon wq and then enter still in the terminal source tilde slash dot bash profile okay time to see if we have php7 up and running first let's verify that we are not using the pre-installed php anymore which PHP. Great, so the path has changed and PHP minus V now, it says PHP 7. So we successfully installed PHP 7. Now quickly let's install Composer. Here we have the commands required to install the latest Composer version. So let's copy this one. And this one requires sudo. The second one. The third one. sudo and the last one again sudo all right let's see if we can access composer so it says no such file or directory and it gives us the path let's see what there is there usr local bin make sure you show all folders in your finder even hidden folders so we notice here that there is no composer even if we just installed it that's because we have not moved it here. sudo mv composer.phar and we will move it to usr local bin composer. Let's go back and verify that the composer now is here. So let's run this. Composer, now it works. Let's finish this tutorial by installing Laravel 5.3. 
I will move to the folder where I keep my Laravel projects. So CD, YouTube, projects, Laravel. The command to install a Laravel project now is very simple. So if you go here, this is the command. So let's try this. Composer create project, Laravel Laravel, and I will name this project Lara53. Once everything is installed, move inside the project, so cd lara53 and run phpartisan serve. This will give you a URL, so let's move to that one. Localhost 8000 and you just installed your first Laravel 5.3 application on Mac. Congratulations!